We can't afford this. This is causing poverty. The price you pay at the pump might already be a shock for some. And as we head into the road trip season, there are several factors that could lead Albertans to see a heftier fuel bill. And they aren't too pumped about it. It's a bit to digest. It adds up. It's compound, uh, compound expense, I guess. Not so much one fill up, but accumulate the 52 fill ups a year. It's pretty brutal. I remember the days when it was like, $20, $30 to fill a car. I ride my bike everywhere, so I don't know. If it promotes less people to drive, I'm okay with that. I fill it up once every two months, but I understand it's a, it's a hurt for a lot of people. A newly increased 14.3 cents per litre for the federal carbon tax isn't the only factor fueling the jump in gas prices. The chair of the World Petroleum Council in Canada saying, with OPEC announcing a surprise cut in the amount of crude they plan to pump, plus the war in Ukraine and the increase Increase in demand for oil as China comes out of lockdown. This outcome was anticipated. So all those big macro factors are putting putting pressure on oil prices to move up, and that's leading to higher gasoline and diesel prices. Even though the price on the pumps can be daunting, for the whole of Alberta and our economy, there are some positives. Our economy tends to be stronger when oil prices are high. For Alberta, it hurts us as consumers, but we certainly benefit as taxpayers and owners of the resource. But the Alberta director for the Canadian Taxpayers Association saying Albertans need to prepare for the federal mandatory minimum carbon tax to triple by 2030. So folks who are spending 10 bucks extra per minivan, 16 bucks extra per pickup truck, and 150 bucks extra per big rig fill, triple that cost within the next seven years. If you can't afford it, you got to pick up the phone and you got to tell your politicians that. Right now, the price for regular gas in Calgary is between 137.9 and 145.9 per litre. Diesel is between 134 and 156.9. Price is not expected to go down significantly anytime soon. In Calgary, Bailey Nitty, City News.